This is TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good morning, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFN at 10 a.m. Eastern Time, 30 minutes into the trading day. And we got markets accelerating off the open. Seems to be the trend recently, right? I mean, look at all these accelerations, man. We accelerate higher pre-market. We sell lower into the day as the opening bell. Uh, you back it up to last Thursday, we sell off in the beginning of the day. You back it off to last Friday, we sell off in the beginning of the day. You back it up to last Monday, we sell off in the beginning of the day. You back it up to last Tuesday, uh, excuse me, yesterday, Tuesday, you sell off in the beginning of the day and the end of the day, and what do we just do? We sold off, but guess what? We've gotten enough rallies, okay, that we are at the same exact price point as we were at Wednesday morning pre-market. Isn't that amazing? We've sold off every single day, and meanwhile, we're sitting at the same exact price point because we're getting moves of about 40 to 50 points in both directions left and right in this market, man. So keep your stops tight, look for some moves. Don't be afraid to take losses, folks, because it, you can take a lot of losses when you catch a run of 20 S&P points if you're keeping things tight to three to five points on your flip side, especially if you're able to pick an area. And boy, I'd say that this thing's bond. I mean, look at the lower boundary line, right? 41.22 seems to be an area of support going back. And then we have the upper boundary line that I was talking about at the beginning of my program. So markets roll over a bit. We're still positive by five in the S&P, NASDAQ 100, barely in the red right now. You got the Dow up by 82 points. You got the Russell flat. We jump over to Target following their earnings. They trade higher by 1.7%. We have Walmart out with their numbers tomorrow morning. They actually trade lower. Not sure they liked what was coming out of Target there on the open as Walmart, down about a quarter percent on their numbers. We got Home Depot yesterday. Look at that, man. Home Depot gets it all back between yesterday and today. Home Depot's up 2% right now. <coughs> Excuse me, at 288, we'll call it. As I mentioned, man, you know, 48 hours ago, Monday, the last thing we knew was Home Depot for the fiscal year was going to have sales that were basically flat on their earnings Tuesday morning. They said they're going to be down fiscal year 2 to 5%, man, and they shake it off in a big way. We got lows next week with their numbers. Lows up 1.3% today. Folks, stay tuned. We got our man Jacob filling in for Basil. Jacob's coming up next. We got Steve Rhodes live at 11, Fast Market at 12, Larry Pesavento live at 1, Tom O'Brien, my dad, live from 3 till 4. We got a Fast Market going on, folks. Stay tuned. Don't forget about Kevin Hanks' program at 12 today. They're going to be talking about Walmart. They're going to be talking about Cisco. They're going to be talking about Take-Two Interactive.